Assalamu alaikum, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are well and okay. Um, welcome to another Ramadan vlog. <laughs> guys, I know I didn't start um, in the beginning and I hope you guys' Ramadan has been going smoothly, mashallah. Guys, alhamdulillah, we have reached the 10 days and um, yeah, I just wanted to really this year focus on my Ramadan not really be on socials and stuff but to say that i have been on social media and just been like getting stuff for myself but also sharing little that one that i know so yeah mashallah for that i get really shy when people are around and i i just can't vlog but anywho so guys i know the lighting is really poor but as i was saying i hope you guys have been enjoying your ramadan so far been doing all the things that we need to do such as dhikas, adkas, duas, istifar good tarawih, good salah, charity, feeding each other, eating good food and just reflecting on this month and inshallah for a change as well for all of us, the whole entire Muslim Ummah, say Amin. Guys I had to move back to the line because that line is poor, I'm trying to do different angles for you guys but it's not working. But long story short, I'm about to pray my tarawih prayers. I was going to go to the mosque today, which I should have, and I haven't gone to the mosque, which I'm a bit upset about, um, to go and do tarawih. I've done to, I've gone to Juma during Ramadan, but I haven't gone and done tarawih, which I'm a bit annoyed. But inshallah, we still have time. So I'll try and go at least for one, at least for one, if not one, you know? But yeah, so yeah, so I'm going to come and do my tarawih. And normally, what I normally do really and truly after that is I will catch up on shows. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to keep it real and simple. Or, um, what's it called? I obviously do my duas, read my Quran. And also, um, I also learn, because I'm learning about like the surahs and then what they actually mean and stuff. So then I'll show you guys anyways. But yeah. But also, at 9 o'clock now for the last 10 days, there's this Islamic help webinar called Knowing Allah and it's about Allah's 99 names. So I suggest you go and tune into that because it's really, really good. I'll put the link down in the description box below. And yeah, I don't want to keep talking. I don't want these vlogs to be too long. Just a little snippet on my day because obviously what am I going to do? I'm fasting. I'm fasting. <laughs> and you're going to see the basics of me doing things that we're meant to be doing anyways in Ramadan and obviously in life, but you'll see. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. Hope you guys enjoy these vlogs and yes, just a disclaimer, I haven't bought out content in a long time, I know that, but it's because I have content, but um, I was just trying to take a break this whole Ramadan, but actually, I'm back, so yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> okay, so I've decided to film in cinematic because why not? But mashallah, I finished my tarawih prayers and now I'm about to make some tea um and guys when i tell you that tarawi before i put the kettle on actually mashallah like i just mashallah i feel like it was just one of my best ones not yeah one of my best it wasn't the best but it was one of my best you know so mashallah like and obviously because it is the last 10 days guys we need to make dua i can't stress this enough we need to make dua like any little thing we need to make dua especially for example the Layla Tokado one where we're trying to get the days um, from the odd nights. It could be tonight, the one that I'm speaking to you right now, or any other night. But we don't know. Let's just continue. Let's continue, guys. So, yeah. If you want to follow me, for, if you don't have me on my socials already, if you're new to this channel, hi, my name is Coco Ames K. I know I never introduced myself, but it's so bad. But um, you can follow me um, on Instagram, on Snap. And then you can get some gems from there because I have a, on Snapchat I have my Ramadan diary story, and then on Instagram I just show my story of what I do in the day, practically like a mini vlog. But you guys get the full gist. So yeah, I look crusty and dusty. Um, right now, um, for iftar, I had what did I have? Croissants. I had croissants. I had um, mocha, basically a mocha. And then after that we had fish cakes my mom made fish cakes and we had it with chips and she made some sauce on the side some caramelized onion sauce and it was 10 out of 10 and then now and then i also had cheetos and i had the lemon lipton iced tea guys i'm obsessed hold on i'm very much obsessed with this 
if you want to get this for me, be out by all means. I'm here for you. Get me the case or the crate for Eid present. Love you. <laughs> so for my that was my snack that I just explained to you. Um, but for my dessert, I'm going to have munch bunch because that's what I've been craving. I was thinking about that today. Oh yeah, by the way, I just got back onto my fast as well. Um, from my break, Mother Nature, and I'm also gonna have a protein bar. That I love. This is my favorite one, and then also I'm gonna make my favorite tea, which is the Vitality. You guys can't really see it. This is really bad. The Vitality tea. It's mint, apple, pear, and nettle by Twinings. Ten out of ten. Chef's kiss for me. I keep saying that now and keep doing like an Italian. But yeah, and now I'm gonna come and catch up on my Quran studies. Guten morning. <laughs> Jacob. Asalaamu Alaikum. Juma Mubarak. Hey guys, it is Friday today. Yesterday, I didn't really do much. As I said, as you guys saw, I was just with my books. I had my dessert. And then for Suhoor, I had my protein um, yogurt and two bagel thins. I love bagel thins. Do you guys love bagel thins? And water. And a little bit of apple juice but yeah that's what i had so i've woken up now i was wanting to wake up a little bit earlier but it's fine alhamdulillah um i can't really blame myself because yeah and yeah so right now i'm going to be um reading my surah al kaf and listening to it and also just doing some islamic studies and fill out my ramadan journal and then i'll catch you guys in a bit i must say guys I just love working in my bed sometimes like oh well, majority of the time it's really fun especially if I had work right now I would have my laptop in my bed for the first like it's up until 12 I feel like after the afternoon you need to get up but like, there's no way you can still be in the bed <laughs> so guys I've taken out my fit that I'm going to wear today um I've done my bed etc um so this is what I'm gonna wear I'm gonna have my ebony wood and universal oud mixed together my jewellery, very minimal, my bag, and I'm wearing all black today, an all black fit with my mules as well. So guys, I'm in the midst of getting ready. Um, I've had my shower, put on my contacts. I'm gonna come and just quickly do light makeup because I wanna look cute. Um, and yeah, I would always say like, sorry, I've got Mufti at the back. Yeah, so, sorry Mufti. But yeah, so I was going to say that like, um, yeah, I see so much better with these contacts. And because I want to do a buyer shopping today, I didn't tell you guys, but I really want to go a buyer shopping. So that's one of my plans. Um, but yeah, so let me do my quick makeup. I want to try and sit you down and see if I could do like a, a montage. But my lighting in my room is just terrible. Let me try to do it like here. This is the best angle you can get, guys. Honestly, I'm so sorry. Sorry, not sorry. But yeah, I need to get my mirror. Give me a sec. And this is me guys yes a Jumma Mubarak I wanted to show my earrings today so yeah but I'm most probably gonna put it inside but these are my earrings anyways and yeah let me show you my outfit ignore my messy room first of all but this is my outfit of the day I'm wearing this abaya and then also the abaya on top it's an open one and this is how it looks at the bottom and yeah and my scarf I just did it like this and I'm wearing my jewellery and yeah, so I'm running late. Not late, but yeah. <laughs> So guys, I'm in 
the shop um, I was in Almuna and I got something in there now and hey, the beautiful hijabs and the popes. Which one to pick? I'm so conflicted. <laughs> They're all nice. Yeah, all of them. Nice. Guys, look at me and my many bags. Did I plan to buy all of these things? Uh, no. Guys, it's an hour later and I'm still here. Like, the most people have things already left and I'm still here. Like, it's packed of people. Yeah. Now I'm on to the next stop and then I'm going home. Salam beautiful people, I am back home now, alhamdulillah guys, I am knackered when I tell you I'm knackered. Um, I've just got back in and guys, it was an amazing shop, like I smell of good sense right now, you don't understand like, if I go here, if I go there, if I go there, I just smell good, I wish you guys could smell me, but let me show you guys what I got and then I'm going to go and do my iftar prep because yeah. So first and foremost, I got a jilbab. My first ever Jill Bob. I'm so excited from um what do you call it from the shop uh what's that shop called? Imam Oxygen. So yeah, and this was $29.95, basically 30 pounds. And then I also got I also got some scarves as well from the market because I needed some scarves. I needed jersey scarves in particular because I like jersey scarves. So yeah, guys, I'm so sorry. This is not good presentation, but you guys can get the gist. Like, you know, TikTok will see it nicely and then you guys see it so rough. <laughs> so yeah, so this is that. And then in terms of perfume wise. Oh yeah. And then I also got like a hijab magnet. So I've got two and then the pens as well. And then um, from Almanar, the shop, I got the bonnet, so the thing that you wear underneath your hijab. And then I also got a book, again, The Fortress of Muslim. It's a du'a from the Quran and Sunnah, so it's got plenty du'as. I saw this on Amazon, and it was £4.50 in the shop al Manar, So it's right next to um, Whitechapel Mosque. And then I also got um, this. This is Good Girl. Guys, go and get it. It's £5. You can get the bigger one for 10 I think, or 8 but it's really good <laughs> and then ah, guys i'm really gassed about this one because ah, basically i went into the shop cave obviously and then i saw this on tiktok the one that i'm going to show you right now and it's called shoreditch sand guys when i tell you this like inshallah i'm gonna just get the big bottle as well because this is amazing but anywho long story short the guy gave this to me for free guys can you imagine only because um i was talking to him nicely we we're just having a good we had a good five minute conversation he was talking to me about and where i work that's where he goes to the gym like it's crazy like it's mad so yeah so i'm gonna go there next time and proper like buy and stuff inshallah but yeah so that's him anywho then the, the famous al baraka shop yes the famous al baraka shop um al baraka al barak i got these three perfumes guys this is my fave love it and then obviously these are the fake versions of these um is it baccarat rouge but obviously this is called barakat rouge <laughs> but it smells exactly the same no cap and i got a good good bargain and deal so i suggest you guys go and yeah that's pretty much it i think that's all i got um actually oh yeah and then they gave me like a free bar soap as well so yeah 
that's my shop that's what i did that's the damage that i caused and i also bought my mum um two perfumes as well and they were amazing but i got them from the imam shop and they're doing a discount i think i showed you guys the two for 20 pounds so yeah go and check it out and guys how can i almost forget i actually got a promo and it's pink and yes and i got a matching tasty with it as well so yes guys that's my shop for today i'm so excited and happy i wanted more abayas though i'm not gonna lie but right now i had to come and prepare iftar and plus um i want to really like look for good abayas do you know what i mean so yeah okay guys you need to excuse my messy room i'm gonna sort it out don't worry but this is basically a buyer that my mom is selling um she's selling them for 20 pounds there's different colors there's like a pinky one there's also a yellowy one there's there was an orange one but that one sold out so yeah she's only got three left and the yellow one goes with like a blue sort of vibe the pinky one goes with like a pinky vibe but it's really nice and you can wear them for iftari and it's 20 pounds so come and get some so y'all i have basically seasoned my stuff um i saw this recipe on tiktok very quick and simple and easy and yeah i'm just gonna wash my rice and then bada boom bada boom then we're gonna make the bakhir <laughs> so now guys i'm making the bakhir um if you don't know what bakhir is honestly i just love saying the name but it's moroccan pancakes and um you put semolina all-purpose flour which is plain flour yeast um sugar salt and baking powder so yeah that's what i got here and then i'm gonna add water and then i'm gonna fry them up around 8 40 ish something like that i mean 8 40 is tell a lie 7 40. the thing is with me i legit see like recipes online and i just want to try them out and yeah that's legit legit <laughs> <laughs> My fast with your sustenance. The thirst is gone and the veins are quenched, and reward is confirmed if Allah wills. Now is the time you buy penny appeal. Oh, my God.